Today we will learn how is a star born. Like a living thing, a star also born, evolves in its life and ultimately comes to the declining stage. In this video, let's take a brief overview on these stages. Birth of a star In the empty spaces between stars in a galaxy, there are huge clouds of gas and dust called interstellar clouds. The sizes of interstellar clouds are about a few light years, a light year being equal to 9.5 multiplied by 10 raised to the power 12 kilometers. Due to some events, the clouds get contracted and so the volume decreases and temperature and density increases. So, a dense hot sphere of a gas is formed. At a suitable temperature, a kind of chemical reaction called nuclear fusion begins at the center and a star is said to be born. In the sun, hydrogen acts as fuel, that is, energy is generated by fusion of hydrogen nuclei so as to form helium nucleus. Stability of stars When the firecracker explodes, the smoke spreads everywhere. Then, why does such a huge explosion not cause spreading of gas cloud in space? The reason is the gravitational force between the particles which constantly tries to bring the particles close together. As the gas pressure which acts away from the center is balanced by gravitational force which acts towards the center, the star remains stable for many years. Guess what will happen if any one of them is larger than other? I hope you have understood this topic very well. Thanks for watching this video.